What's up, y'all? What's the deal? It's Tamika. Yeah, I'm on my break here at work. And I just wanted to come to y'all and talk to y'all about something. So, y'all know I've been, like, getting everything together with this promotion. I'm also in the process of moving. Not out of state like I originally was planning on doing, but I'm trying to move into another apartment. So, I'm looking for a new place to stay, still get acclimated to this new position. But, with that being said, I wanted to just talk to y'all about some things that I've come across while on YouTube. And it's kind of disheartening. And I really don't care how many dislikes I get or negative comments I get. You know, talk about it ain't your business. And if you don't want nobody to clap back at you you just might as well just stay out of it blah 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 who are you anyway well who am i i am tamika renee hutchins so i'm gonna speak on it okay so when i first joined youtube y'all i just thought this would be a cool thing for me to do to not only you know help me with my brand but also with me trying to get into journalism I just thought this would be a great outlet and I can meet some really cool people which I have shout out to the ghetto view man she was one of my first supporters shout out to Ashley Miller who gave me great advice shout out to Bondi Blue who gave me great advice when I first started shout out to my boy you know <laughs> James Caldwell, who was following me from the very beginning, always commenting, always giving me encouragement. Shout out to Deborah Deshaun. Like, shout out to everybody. Like, I love y'all. But with that being said, I've been seeing some stuff that's just really, I don't know, y'all. It just really disheartening, like I said. So, it, I guess it all started with, you know, all these YouTube beefs. And it just seemed like all of a sudden, they just been happening back to back to back. First, you know, I think it was S. Hutchinson with Lady Nika. And then it was cemented with, you know, some people with the Fresh Collective. And then, you know, then it's this whole thing with Funky Dineva and Michelle Brown. And then, you know, it was some other stuff that happened the other day with the Scorpion show and Justin Day and it was just like wow I, I just didn't know I just didn't know that this platform could just be so cutthroat you know I just feel as though we all supposed to be here to support each other to help promote each other and uplift each other at the end of the day because at the end of the day we all have one common goal to express ourselves and to help grow our brand so if we all have the same goal and same common ground i don't understand where all the beef and all the pettiness is coming from i really don't i feel as though that since youtube has now become this really viable platform where people can get on you know like expand their brands or get on a TV show or you know get people to get on their blogs and get interviews for people that now it's become real crop throat like everybody is being petty trying to you know shade each other and try to talk down at each other like oh well you talking about this well you don't got that or you know and all this and it's just like no that's not what we hear about at least that's not why I joined like I tell you I have been on YouTube and subscribing to people's channels and following people like a good year before I got my channel because number one first of all I was totally shy and every time I would try to do a video for some reason it would upload so I was just like it must not meant to be and the last time I tried it it took it uploaded, so I've been here ever since. But yeah, I always thought that it was so much camaraderie. And then when you, like I said, especially recently, it's just been so much. And I'm just like, why? Why though? Don't we all have the same 
agenda, the same initiative? And I guess the question, I guess the answer is yes. But everybody want to, instead of everybody helping each other, everybody want to cut each other deep to try to get to the finish line instead of helping each other cross the finish line at the same time. You know, it's room for everybody. Everybody can get out. Like, I I mean, I love, one thing I love about the Get Up You, she does, you know, her support Tuesdays. Her, her main motto is all about support. And I'm the same way, you know, I do my little shout out videos or whatever. And per, because I just feel like we should uplift each other. We should, if we enjoy a channel or if it's somebody that's up and coming that needs some support, I think we should do that. If somebody that you were cool with surpasses you or they have an idea that's taking off or something, congratulate them. You know what? Help them evolve. Because guess what? While you're helping them evolve, you can meet somebody or you could be doing something to help them and that can help you get some shine. You can meet somebody by helping them, or they could be like, you know what, you really helped me, you know, so now I want to in turn help you. But all this pettiness, y'all, I just, I just don't get it, and it's really disheartening. Anyway, y'all, leave this down in the comments. Like I said, I know I'm a new YouTuber, and I had no right to speak on all this stuff, but it was just kind of disheartening, so I wanted to get it off my chest. Okay, y'all, till next time, peace and love.